G'day YouTube. This video will show you guys how to install the GNOME desktop environment, also known as the GNOME Shell or GNOME 3.0 desktop environment in Linux Mint. Now, if uh, you're like me, you've got the default version of Linux Mint, the Cinnamon Desktop uh, Edition, but if you don't like that at desktop environment, I can show you guys how to install the GNOME uh, desktop environment there. So first of all, what you do need to do is open up a terminal there and pretty much type in the following command. Now, one thing I guess I will let you know is I am currently in the, uh, the GNOME desktop environment so I do know that it works it's uh, quite successful that sort of thing one thing I will mention though whenever you're working with desktop environments for whatever reason it uh, can be a little bit uh, messy or dangerous so I do recommend you definitely back up all of your uh, important data first before you do anything like this so moving on uh, what you do, do need to do here is do the following command it's quite a long one so I'll stretch this out so you need to uh, have root privileges so sudo apt install and then the name of the packages that we we'll use so gnome shell gnome shell extensions gnome tweak tool gdm and uh, gnome control center these two aren't as important but I would recommend them. GDM is actually the GNOME uh, Display Manager which really means the, the login screen for the most part. Uh, so let's go ahead and uh, hit enter, throw in your password and go and install. Now once that's done, all good, uh, what you do need to do is either log out, log back in or I'll show you with the login out now because you do need to change a small setting there. So let's go to log out, log out and here we go. Now one thing you'll see is the gear icon. So basically you'll have to switch on to GNOME there. Uh, it will currently look like uh, Cinnamon or Cinnamon Software Rendering perhaps depending on what you're doing. But switch to GNOME, throw in your password and jump in there and you'll find you've got uh, your la your latest version of the GNOME in uh, Linux Mint. So most people probably won't go for this option. If someone does like a default GNOME experience they'll probably go with Ubuntu these days. But uh, that's pretty much it guys, just a super simple and quick video to show you guys uh, how to get the, the GNOME desktop environment working in Linux Mint 18. Cheers guys, hope you've enjoyed.